Okay. Have you noticed how many rules that there are in the Bible? Like, the Bible is basically this one giant rule book, and sometimes it's hard to follow all of the rules at once. Like, when it says, the Bible says, do not lie, and it also says, honor your father and mother, and when you're going into the buffet, they're like, Josh, if they ask, you're 12, okay? <laughs> God says, yeah, you're all born into sin. So it's like, here's a rule book. You're going to break any, you're going to break a couple of them. Oh, well. And, you know, it's it's really hard to keep all the rules in check, especially all those Ten Commandments. And they have to say, like, when Jesus came, and it's like a new law and all that stuff. And, you know, a great, great honor to your father and mother. That's a great commandment to follow, especially because your parents are only there to protect you, not really hurt you. Siblings, They'll do whatever they want, but your parents, <laughs> they, they want to keep you safe and nurture you. The only, you, you, you only get really embarrassed when they start showing like your girlfriend your baby pictures when you're naked. So, yeah, that's, that, that's pretty embarrassing. Or, or when they're like, bye Joshua, have a nice day at school. <laughs> Thanks mom. And, you know, your parents, oh, they really only want to try and help you. Like the other day, I wanted to go to a party. And my parents were like, no, Josh, you can't go out to be with your friends. You have to study. And I was like, I don't want to study. No, no, no. And I was kicking and screaming and crying on the floor. <laughs> Yesterday wasn't fun, people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and my dad, he's, he's really big, like, big on rules, right? He was like, Joshua, you got to study. you got to follow this. You have to read the Bible every day. got to pray. you got to study. Keep your studies first. Go to Harvard. Then graduate. Be pre become president. Be like... Okay, Dad, I'll, I'll do that, okay? He's like, then you have to be leader of the world. Le you. I'm like, Dad, this isn't Star Wars. I can't just... <laughs> <laughs> and even, even, though, even though they will try and give me, like, high expectations, I know they'll probably lower them so I could get a little bit higher. Like, like, when, you, like when you go in and be like, Dad, I thought I failed my test. And you'll be like, what? And you'll be like, no, nah, but I just got to see instead. It's fine. That, 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 that's, that's a great... That works a lot, people, trust me. <laughs> yeah, but... I do do very well in school. And you know what's another great rule? Treat others how you would want to be treated. Like my uncle, for instance. I started playing volleyball recently, and my uncle only came to one of my games, my first scrimmage, and I was horrible, people. Like, really, really bad. Like, if the ball was coming toward me, I'd get scared because it was going too fast. I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> and like, when kids were going to spike, and like, I had to block. I used like I used to try and like soften the blow by like, pulling my hands back, and they'd be like, ah. <laughs> so he'd be like, Josh, you're so bad at volleyball. Just tell me, just tell me when you get good, so I'll start to come in when you get good. <laughs> so then I started getting better, and he kept calling me trash, and I was like, okay, let's settle this once and for all. So I took a long extension cord and I tied it to like the post of like his like it's like a lamp post and a tree, and then we started playing volleyball with like the extension cord, and. It wasn't regulation extension cord, people. Like, <laughs> it, was, it was like right here, so I could just like hit right here. And every time I would go to jump, my body would be like up here, and the ball would be right here. So every time he used to be like, you're so trash, we got this, and he used to pull my cousin over. My cousin is like the most athletic person you'll ever meet. Like, my uncle only puts him on his team because he wants to win, right? Like, he knows I'm bad at basketball, and he'll put me on a team with my uncle Jerry, who he's trying to beat, and he'll put him on a team with my cousin Justin, who's like really athletic. And Justin, let's, let, me, let me clarify, we played a game of 21. Justin got 20 points. Our t entire team combined got two. <laughs> my uncle got one. <laughs> and he came out, he's like, whoa, we beat them, we beat them! I was like, no, Justin! <laughs> time he kept calling me trash, I got really mad, right? And he was like, I'm gonna spike on you so hard, I'm gonna spike on you. And he did spike, but I blocked it, and then his face turned really red. And my mom was like, good job Joshua, good job! <laughs> mom, stop embarrassing me! <laughs> and, then, and then it was my turn to spike, right? So I go, I slam down on the ball, and he gets scared. Like, he does the little, oh, no, thing with the ball. And he's like, how'd you learn to become that good? And I said, you know, practice. And then he's like, practice? Do they give you steroids at practice or something? <laughs> but, no. Just remember, though, 
Rules are put for there for a reason. You gotta follow them, people. Thanks. <laughs>